uh, and and I'm buying two and a half times earnings of a business. So I'll uh, so like for example, I'll I'll, I'll send you on a treasure hunt. How's yes, that? Yes, sure, treasure sure. hunt is more <laughs> more exciting than giving you the treasure, right? Sure, sure. It's always better to hunt for the treasure. So. I mean, I, I, have an, I have an insight, and I don't know whether the insight will be right or wrong. Uh, you can tell me. So uh, we know that there is lots of different permutations and combinations of changes happening in the way humans travel, right? So we used to have cars and public transport and taxis. That was it, right? Now you have Uber, you have Uber Pool, you might get to autonomous, Waymo, uh, we might, uh, there's a lot of different companies. We have, some of you might be familiar with Via in uh, New York, uh, which I think is great. And so the end result is that uh, humans have a lot more options available for transport and mobility, and the price is coming down. And also you have, you know, low gas prices and so mm -hmm. on. So it is an absolute certainty in my mind that per capita miles being driven in some kind of public transport for humans is going up. Mm -hmm. uh, I mean, I remember when I was a student, you know, I had my bicycle and mobility was very restricted because I was poor. I didn't have a lot of places I could go. Now I just see with my kids, you, you can go anywhere. So if miles driven per human are going up, uh, how can you play that? Well, one way you can play that is tire companies. Okay, so no matter what happens, there, I'm almost sure there'll be more tires sold five years from now or 10 years from now versus today. And actually, if we get to electric cars taking off, uh, you know, they want weight reductions. Mm -hmm. So then they make those tires paper thin. How many have a Tesla here? No Tesla owners. It's a value crowd. Oh, value investing. Yeah. Yeah. Hardcore value crowd. <laughs> All right. So you know that uh, like uh, the Teslas and the, the Leafs and all that, they have these special tires which don't last very long and they cost a lot um, because they want to keep the weight down. And so those are even better for the tire company. They keep wearing out very fast. So my take was that uh, tires will do well. And so I, I made an investment uh, in a company in India, which was really cheap, which made uh, one of the ingredients that goes into uh, rubber that goes into tires, and that's that's I think that will do very well. And the other was a company in Korea, uh, which uh, is in one shape or another in the tire business, and it's growing actually. It's it's going to grow quite a bit. It's it's actually uh, even without these demographic things happening, it'll still grow. And you know, if I'm buying at two and a half or three times, uh, in three years, I have all my cash back. So that's it, the beauty of PE of three. So it's a tire related company in Korea with a PE of three <laughs> <laughs> for the treasure hunt. Yeah, have fun. Yeah. <laughs>